Hello to all my viewers. This is Dr. Tawal Mehta and today we are going to discuss how to run Kendall Tawabi in Jamawi. The Kendall's Tawabi correlation coefficient is a non-parametric measure of the strength and the direction of association that exists between two variables measured on at least on ordinal scale. It is considered a non-parametric alternative to the Pearson's product moment correlation when your data has failed one or more assumptions of this test. It is also considered an alternative to the non-parametric Spearman rank order correlation coefficient, especially when you have a small sample size with many tied ranks. Now, let's see how we can do this in Jamawi. For this purpose, I am using this data set, which is a voting data set. I want to find out the association between the gender, which is captured as male and female and last voting done yes or no both of them are on bind on are on binary scale i'll go into regression correlation matrix and i'll transfer gender and last voting make sure candle survey is on and i've got the results i'll simply copy this result in my word file here what will be my research hypothesis? Voting and age are positively associated with each other. I'll convert this research hypothesis into the null hypothesis. There is no significant association between voting and age. Alternative, there is a significant association between voting and age. Now, let's see the p-value of this test. As the p-value of Kendall Starby is 0.325, which is more than 5% level of significance. So we fail to reject null hypothesis, which means that there is no significant association between voting and age. In case if this value was less than 0 0.05, we would have gone for the tabulation, cross tabulation of these two variables. How we can do this? Let's see. I'll go in exploration, activate descriptives. I'll transfer. age category here not age category i'll transfer gender and last voting i'll activate the variables across rows and i'll click on frequency table and you can see here we have got the results now i'll copy this result in the word file. This interpretation is to be only done when your p-value is less than 0 0.05 and we get some association between the two variables. So here our interpretation will be that in case of May, 2983 respondents did not vote it which is 31.6 percentage. In case of male, 1941 voted, which is 20.5 percentage of the total respondents. In case of female, 2786 did not vote it, which is 29.5 percentage of the total voters or the total respondents. In case of female, those who voted, uh, the figure is 1739, which is 18.4 percentage of the total voters. This interpretation is only to be done in the scenario when your p-value is significant. So for more videos on Jamovi, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Please refer my playlist in which I already uploaded many videos of Jamovi.